Hey guys, I wanted to show you my uh, design for my magnet holder. This is it. This is what it looks like. Uh, this is what I drew up anyway. Now I do not have a mill of any sort, so it'd be really hard to make this. I'm gonna make it out of plastic, uh, Lexan or plexiglass, probably plexiglass. Uh, it's half inch. Um, this way, and I'm gonna cut it. 7 8 Now I do not have, like I said, do not have a mill or anything like that, so I'm making this piece with a uh, table saw and a miter saw and a drill press. And uh, from this, now I, I designed the corners here, but my uh, table saw isn't going to cut that properly with the, the way I want it, so I'm just going to leave it square. But uh, this program is called SketchUp and uh, Google makes it and it's free it's a pretty cool program but from drawing to real life here is my piece this is uh, just like this got my hole in there my taper but uh, basically how I did this was uh, I cut some two inch strips uh, this way so I just ripped it this way and then I went back and uh, made this table saw so high and cut the bottom out flipped it over and cut the top out and then that gives me this and then on my mortar saw, my miter saw come over here and I had this all set up to where I cut perfect pieces and this how this works is uh, this magnet sits right in the top here just like that and then this gets mounted on the side of my wheel just like this and uh, I got nylon screws. Uh, it's going to go with some sort of a stainless, but I figured nylon would be tough enough. I'm going to glue it anyway. So this screw fits nicely down in there. And uh, I got to drill holes out on my rotor here. But yeah, I thought you guys would like some uh, backyard engineering with the table saw. This fits nicely on there. I could zip tie this and uh, put it like this and I could I was gonna cut some grooves in the back and put a zip tie around here but I figured the zip tie would stick out too far uh, for my tolerances being close to my uh, coil so uh, sorry I got a little burn there so uh, yeah anyway should I show you that so you guys can make stuff like this without uh, without fancy tools just some uh, normal tools that most people or somebody that you know might have uh, but that's it I'll uh, give you an update whenever I get this uh, drilled out I'm going to uh, mount this to a drill press and uh, hopefully drill holes in it and tap them out so when I'm done I'll show you see you